My name is Joseph Thomas, owner and operator of JoeyCuts.com LLC, also founder of the No Joey Foundation. Uh, JoeyCuts.com uh, began back in 2007. Uh, we opened up JoeyCuts Barber Salon, it used to be located off 39th Indiana. We have now expanded and grown into 18OV Barber Salon that's located on the corner of 18th and Vine, 1805 Vine actually. Uh, we've, I've been in business ownership now for a little over eight years. Uh, the No Joy Foundation has been in existence since 2007 as well. Um, from 2007 till now, we've fed thousands of families, gave away over a thousand free haircuts, uh, book bags, school supplies, resources, scholarships, the whole nine. Um, really have a heart for my community, really have a passion for the people, uh, really have a passion for not only my legacy, but also uh, um, uh, how effective the legacy will be. Um, I'm thankful for this opportunity, uh, working with these young guys right now, doing this interview, and uh, stay tuned for more. Okay. So, Joey, we're here in this very luxurious office of yours, and today you're having your barber class. So, can you please speak on that, and how did it come about? Okay, so the barber class is itself, um, it's a look, learn, and execute series. Um, pretty much, we've, we've been doing that for a couple months. Um, the goal, really, honestly, is, is to help sharpen skills for barbers, you know, uh, look, learn, execute itself. The look and learn part is kind of, you know, self-explanatory. Come to class, you actually get to look and learn te different techniques, uh, new approaches, new assessments, the whole nine. And as far as the execution part of it, um, I opened up 12 stations inside of 18 OV Salon, and the first 12 people who sign up and register, they can uh, uh, man a station and bring in their own uh, model, tools, all that kind of stuff, and we can actually do a hands-on with them. So not only do you get to look and learn the class itself, but now you get to actually uh, apply what you may have learned. For about eight years now, you've been known for having a fresh cut, fresh start event in August before kids go to school. Can you speak on the history of this and what are some new things you're adding to the event this year? Okay, so Fresh Cut, Fresh Start was... Um, is an event where young men come to receive free haircuts, school supplies, uh, backpacks, resources, and whatever else they need to have a, a fresh cut and a fresh start for their school year. Our goal is to motivate them, uh, rejuvenate them, get them properly ready, looking good, feeling good, just ready to go back to school. That was our primary focus um, seven years ago or eight years ago. Here it is now, fast forward eight years later, not only do we do that for young men, we have a parent-only zone where they can go in and get utility assistance, they can get more education and awareness and knowledge about scholarships and colleges and different uh, ideas for their kids and for themselves. Uh, we have a kid zone where we read books and they get free books and um, uh, they have fun over there. And this year we plan to partner with the mayor because 18OV itself, we're already partnered with the Dad Turn the Page KC uh, program. So that's an initiative that the mayor has where he wants uh, books placed inside of different barbershops. And when kids come in there with their parents, the parents can actually read to their kids while they wait. And uh, all the books are free. And I'm not talking about old books that's torn apart. These are brand new books, books I've never even seen before. Um, uh, so we got the kids zone. We also have the girls only zone where they can uh, make the dazzle jewelry and they uh, learn basic application for makeup and uh, uh, they make all kind of tie dye shirts and do and get their nails done, have manicures and stuff. So we make it fun for them. And then we also have different sections for all family and all ages or whatnot. Uh, game truck sponsored by uh, courtesy of Wings and things. Um, we have a lot of stuff. Triple Seven Construction. He teaches young men about how to properly drill and hammer and paint and nail and stuff. Um, it just, it's an all day list of activities for everybody, young, old, boy, girl, um, for the whole entire family. We had fire department, police department, Kansas City Zoo. Um, we have a lot of people, man, that come out and just show love, show support. And, and the best part about it all is that it's all free. You know what I mean? It's all free, it's our way of giving back to the community. Uh, the community is actually the people that's truly behind it that make this possible because uh, we reach out to them and ask for that help, that donation, that uh, that volunteer, um, whatever the case, and they come through, the community comes through. So definitely want to say thank you to Kansas City for that, and um, uh, thank you for your support and your love, and keep bringing it because we need it every year.
You out there checking us out. If you're ever in the Kansas City area looking for a barber or stylist, make sure you check us out at 18OV Barber Salon. It's 1805 Vine, Kansas City, Missouri, 64108. Uh, down here on the historic Vine District, um, located inside the historic Lincoln Building. Uh, also, check out joeycuts.com. That's J O E Y C U T S.com. Um, all my social media handles are Joey Cuts. So, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, the whole nine. It's all Joey Cuts. J O E Y C U T S. Stay connected. Uh, for those of you that's wanting to do more for the community and for those that's already doing stuff for the community, uh, reach out. Let's connect because uh, at the end of the day, a lot of the activities and events that we do, I can't do it by myself and I always need help. So, uh, that's just from me to you, but again, for those who have supported the No Joy Foundation, joybecuts.com, 18OV, everything inside the empire, thank you. From the bottom of my heart, thank you. Uh, not only do I, but also my team and my family, we truly appreciate it. Um, and without further ado, you know, just peace and love to everybody out there. And uh, thank you for your time and thank you for your consideration and for watching this. Well, it was a pleasure. It's been long overdue, man. Right, right, straight up, straight up. You know, you've been, he's been coming out here for some years yeah. now. <laughs> All right, y'all, we're out.